What is going on guys and today I'm bringing you another video. This is going to be a bit different. We're going to have free filters and I'm also going to teach you guys how to do them as mass bidding. A lot of you ask me for mass bidding methods and I rarely put them out but this is going to be sniping and mass bidding all in one video for you guys who want to try both. So if you do enjoy, slap a like down below. If you aren't around here, make sure to subscribe. We are growing fast on our way to 3k and of course I'm doing giveaways at every milestone to so make sure to hit that subscribe button. But without further ado, let's get into the video so the three players i'm touching on today some of them you may have seen before in my videos what i'm going to do is i'm going to snipe one of each and then show you the sort of mass bidding techniques we're going to be using so first of all we're looking at digny someone who is phenomenal to snipe in this game he will always be undercut there was a time when i literally did i think 10 minutes on him and made about 30k he used to be one of my favorite players to snipe now you can see he's going for around 5.5k here and you want to realistically pick him up for something about 500 coins below that, 5.5k EA tax is going to be about 200, 300 coins. So you can probably go from about 2.1 and down and pick him up. Now I reckon we'll pick one up within the first 15, 20 seconds of looking because he's really one of the easiest players to snipe on the foot market. I did think that he was probably, I mean it was almost a, a glitch basically. It was so good to snipe him before. I'm just going to try and work it out. So 5,500 10%, uh, 550, half that, we'll go 600, 300 coins. So you can actually pick him up at 5.2 and below, and there you go, oh, we've missed that. We've absolutely scuffed that one there. But that would have been a very lovely snipe. So we're gonna go for one more, and then I'm gonna show you how we would mass bid him. Bid with him? Bid with him. And then we're gonna talk about that. And obviously it's gonna be the same across all three players, and I've picked three players who are really easy to mass bid with. So let's have a look. Is he, is there, there's none at 5.5. There's some at 5.6, one at 5.6, so maybe uh, he's been cleared up a little bit there. Let's have a look. 5.7, he's realistically going for 5.7. Um, we'll call it, let's have a look. So we'll call it 300 coins under that. We'll go for 5.3 and below for profit. You saw the 4, 4K one there. It's a bit gut and we missed that. We're literally going to go for one to show you that it does work as a sniping method, which is what I'm going to do for all the players, show you they work as a sniping filter and then go for it, obviously, as a mass bid. So there you go. We've got that one. 5.2, sell him on for 5.7. Let's have a look. 5.7. There you go. So now we're going to move on to how... Oh, Brilliant, we've got a nice little snipe there, 4.1. That is ridiculous. See, I told you guys, Digny is just, there's something about him that makes him the best player to snipe in the game. I absolutely love sniping him because you always get a good profit. That one there, at least a good K on that. So we're going to back out, hopefully with none more there. So what we're looking at is we're going to want to pick him up for anything under 5.3 on bids. So what you want to do is set the max price to about 5K and then you want to search there. So as you can see, there's a ton here that don't even have bids. So we're going to go for that one. And a lot of these, we're going to get outbid on. And obviously, the mass bidding, the reason I don't do too many videos on it is because actually, there's a lot of the time where, you know, obviously right now, I've already spent a fair few coins in order to bid on him. So try not, if you do have a lower budget, to bid on the 5K one. Because see these ones here, obviously you're seeing 1K and thinking, no, no one's going to, you know, no one in their right mind is going to allow you to get a 1K and actually get it through. But I've seen people like, I think it was Homeless Penguin, who's quite a big sniper uh, here on YouTube. He's, I think he got a Lewandowski once, about 100k under how much he's worth. So that is literally all you want to do to mass bid. So we're going to move on to the next player, who is Sissoko. And we're going to mass bid him and also snipe him. So let's have a look. Sissoko, let's have a look. How much are you going for? 7k. No, you're going for nothing, apparently. What's, what's going on there? A minute ago, I tried to search him and I could not get one for under eight. So I don't know what's going on there, but let's have a look. 1.2, 1.6, 1.9. There you go. So this is a mass bidding filter for someone who's got a little bit less profit. With Digny, um, you are going to obviously have to put a few coins down. So we're going to say he's EA taxing uh, at around there. So we're going to pick that one up straight away. We've missed that one. We're going to go for, I believe it was 900 I could snipe from. We're going to go for there. Okay, we're going to go for a couple of him, by the way. We don't just want one because he's cheap um, or we want one good one. So let's have a look. If we knock that down at least to 1.8 and go from there. And let's have a look. Go on. Easy, 1.5. 
uh, we're going to pop that up for 2.1k and that one was pretty quick as well so once again not having to talk about the method too much we're going to go again and have a look so we want to pick him up at realistically i'd say 1.5 on a bid because he's so cheap you should be able to get some pretty ridiculous deals on him as bidding so we're going to go max price again one point we'll go 1.6 uh, and then we're going to go right we'll have that one there we will have that one there we will have let's have a look at that one there we'll have that one there we will have that one there so a lot of these are obviously going for 650 now if i actually get even five of these at 650 that is going to be a ridiculous profit so you can actually bid on those ones that i'm avoiding on 650 um you will still make coins to be honest you can bid on anything up to around i'd say probably 1.5k and you'll be going to comfortably knowing that you're going to make coins the only thing with 650 is you're guaranteed coins all year round even if it's price drops all of a sudden you'll still make coins so let's have a look more 650s and we can realistically bid every single one of these if we want i've got 108k sat there we could bid as many as we wanted so we're going to go from that and then we're going to move over i'm just going to see how how long the videos so far i don't want to make it too long for you guys so only six minutes so we're going to move on to the final player who is i'm just going to check to make sure he is still going for more than a k first of all and domblay let's have a look can we get him for a k we can get him for a k let's see how cheap we can actually get him and we might only okay so 1k he's 1.1 which means ea tax is 55 coins which means we go to about here and then we can pick him up and we will make profit there you go straight away and double 900 coins these three players are absolutely ridiculously easy to snipe every single one of them you've seen easy snipes not even i mean sissoko was coming in easy and domble is literally seconds digny with the 4k snipe with the one point whatever profit it's really easy to do all these players and i didn't even have to try for any of them you've seen how strenuous some methods can be for me and this one was just easy rolling off the tongue all these players pretty simple so we're gonna go for one more with the end let's have a look can we get one is there gonna be another one let's have a look so if we go for 1k or 1.1k how many pages are there? there's just that one page can we get a compare price snipe oh we've got one there ah i've probably scuffed that oh no way so we can probably sell that one on for 1.1 that's not as much profit you're only getting about 100 coins there but it's still profit so we're going to move on to picking up and domble on a let's have a look on a bidding method so what you actually want for him is really about 800 coins and i think to be honest with him it is much more doable so bid up everyone to about 700 um, and to be honest you're more likely to get in domble than anyone else because he is obviously the cheapest card he's so close to being I mean, his price is only about 100 to 100 of what he's going for on bids. So you can pick him up really easily because people won't want to bid it up because they can't be bothered. And that's the thing with bidding. It doesn't necessarily have to be these massive profits. It's just that you've got to be the less lazy person. So that's all we've got for the bids. Now you can see I've probably been outbid on a few of those. I've been outbid on five. To be fair, that's pretty good. Does that mean I've won some already? have i won some so we've won one digny at 5k now how much were we selling him for let's look back him on the transfer list quickly so we've won one digny at 5k we've missed out on those guys so far so let's have a look so one digny at 5k we're selling digny for 5.7 so that's a 700 coin profit there and we didn't even have to try that one was easy so we're going to put that up and that's going to sell almost immediately for 5.7 so you really can't complain mass bidding is honestly not that difficult and you see there it took me a couple seconds and we've got them up now they might sell a little bit slower it doesn't matter they're still going to make profit if you've enjoyed the video you know what to do smash that like button subscribe share the videos if you really like them but i've been robert and i'll see you guys in the next one